So, receiving the ball in midfield, your positioning is spot on. You've occupied the right spaces. Now that you're receiving the ball, you need to make it count. Otherwise, you've done all that hard work and it's gone down to waste. So let's make sure it doesn't go down to waste. So, you're operating in this pocket of space on the side of the ball. As the ball is fired into you, and it has to be fired into you, otherwise it'll get intercepted. Because you're in this dangerous area, you'll be receiving the ball under pressure and with speed. So, as the ball comes in, your priority is to turn your body position as quickly as possible and face the goal. If you have to take a touch, just like this, facing backwards, you've given the opposition time to regroup and put pressure on you. But, as the ball is coming in, can you be in a position where you're like that? Your body position is facing the way, so you can touch it with your back foot and go and dribble to goal. That's all you're doing. Because if you're receiving the ball square with your shoulders facing where the ball has come, you cannot turn. You taking that extra touch or two touches to turn will give the opposition time to regroup and put pressure on you, meaning that that potential chance for your team has gone. As the ball gets circulated across like this, you're shuffling across, you're operating in this square, your number six gets the ball. Can you get the ball on your back foot with one touch to turn and attack the goal? We call it the half turn. So as an attacking mid, you're not too wide, you're not too central, you're in that pocket of space, attacking that way as the ball comes in your priority should be to take the ball on the foot that is closer to the goal very simple because suddenly now I'm facing the goal if I receive the ball like this I'm still facing my goal until I turn there's pressure this area of the pitch is the area of the pitch with the most amount of pressure so as I've scanned my shoulder the ball comes in I turn I take the ball now I can be direct one more touch and now I could shoot, I could play a through ball, I could switch it. That's where I can express myself as that attacking midfielder. Can you take one touch or maximum two touches to turn and attack? Less touches, more efficiency on body positioning and attacking the goal and making it count. If you found this insightful, the full tactical course is on the Train Effective app. See you there.